Hey guys, I uh, found this out by the dumpster. It's a direct TV satellite receiver. You know, where the, the disc fits here and this sits up over the satellite to receive the signal. I managed to pop the top off this thing. That was pretty easy. But this, they put some screws in here and then this the sealer they put on there, I don't know, I can't get a screwdriver to even work in the screw. So I'm going to have to go at it a different way. I started beating on this side here. See if I can get in there. And I don't know, we'll see. Maybe I can get in between the steel casing. If it wasn't for that sealer, I might be able to see what I'm doing. I can't. So, use the uh, Windows 8 repair tool. Hey, got into something. Mm. That looks like copper down in there. I hope I don't have to do that all the way around. I see a board in there. Let's see if we can go in a different direction. Peel it like a can over. Looks like there are some specialty screws. There's are hex head. There's a couple of look like Phillips. Pretty easy. They really don't want you messing with this thing. I can see what looks like gold reflections off of some of the board. Looks like there's a mess of these screws, so I won't bore you with taking them all out. Okay, well, I got all the screws out of it that I can see, and I'm betting there's more in there that are hidden. I'm going to start pull, trying to pull it apart here. Another, another. Hey, cool. Hmm. That appears to be aluminum. I do like the color of that board. It is nice. There's gold everywhere. Wow. That sure looks like gold. Hmm. Couple little IC chips. Uh, wow. <laughs> I think it's a jackpot. What's under that piece of metal?
But that's another board. And as usual, I see a bunch more screws. swear to it, but I think there's gold under that. That may be gold itself, it's just in this light I can't hardly tell. But at any rate, a couple of IC chips, some really small monolithic ceramic capacitors, these appear to be gold pins with, uh, looks like sword on the end of them. Uh, might be gold. So what I'm going to do is strip all the stuff off of these boards. And then I will take these, cut them up in small pieces. And throw them in with my uh, pins and rocks and things of that nature and scrape all the gold off of them. This all looks looks like gold. I don't know what this light colored stuff is. I'll mess around with it a little bit and see what I can find. But you can see the gold in this and there's more of that light colored stuff. I don't I think that's just ceramic. This one's got some gold in it. That one's got a lot. I like that one. <laughs> All right, well, I'll go ahead and cut these up, clean them off, and then cut them up. Throw them in the pile with the rest of them and do it to it. There's a little gold on there. See a little right in there. Pins here has some gold on. Well, here's the boards I got out of it. The uh, I like this big one. It's all gold, and there's a bunch of inlaid gold. <coughs> this one I uh, took some sandpaper to it, and that's gold underneath all this white stuff. And this one you can see the the gold inlay in the circuit board. So, should be quite a bit in there. And I uh, will take these, cut them up, put them in with my pins. I got a bunch more pins to put in there. The gravel, and the gravel will actually scrape the gold off. And like these, there's nickel underneath the gold. And the nickel being harder than the gold, it scrapes the gold off and leaves the nickel behind. And it works pretty good. So, I'll see you next time.